here on. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on what time it is where you are. Either way, welcome to Pembroke Church of God. I'm Pastor Wayne, and I have a special treat for you today. Two of the people that are responsible for leading worship for our second service are going to share with you our invocation and offertory. This is Adam. This is Haley. I'm going to turn things over to them now. Thank you. Mm -hmm. The advancement and diffusion of knowledge is the only guardian of true liberty. James Madison said that. Now, knowledge, true liberty... We certainly have much to celebrate concerning liberty and freedom, but the truest freedom is not made or kept by man, but found in a relationship with Jesus Christ. John 8, 31 and 32 reads, To the Jews who had believed him, Jesus said, If you hold to my teaching, you are really my disciples. Then you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. We are gathered today to celebrate and honor our God and the true liberty brought through his son, Jesus Christ. Bow your heads with me, please. Glory and strength to you, Lord. We gather this morning or afternoon or evening to worship you because of who you are, Jesus, our King, our Savior, our Liberator. May our words, our meditations, songs, and prayers be pleasing to you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you. Think to yourself, what are you thankful for? Offering gifts to the Lord is an excellent way for us to show our great gratitude, complete trust, and a thorough understanding of who God is, for it is because of him that we are truly free. Let us meditate on God's provision and all we have to be thankful for as we observe a time of offering. Lord, you are sovereign. Your will is perfect. We ask that your perfect will be done with this offering. We commit to this offering, these gifts to your power and perfect will. We ask for your blessing on each of us, on the community around us, and on this church, Lord. Thank you, Haley and Adam. I appreciate you You're participating. Welcome. You guys have a fantastic week. We look forward to the time when we can all be together again, of course, here at Pembroke Church of God. But until then... You are such a beloved part of our church family. Have a blessed week. Have a wonderful day.